Welcome everybody, this is Maxinal and I'm playing Guild Wars 2 and this is character creator. Yeah, I'm gonna start the series with creating a character. I'm gonna start with Char and this series is gonna be all about the game. I'm gonna show you where to level and how to level where the best place are. I'm gonna show you bosses and instances and everything like that. So yeah, I'm gonna be a male, male Char. Yeah, and class, what class would I be? I'm going to be um, warrior, maybe, or a thief. Ah, uh, going to be warrior. So yeah, or a height. Party features. Hi. So yeah, the game is. You can create your own character, unique character, and I think that's really good. So everyone don't look the same. And you see, you see, body mass. I'm gonna be a really fat char warrior, I think. Yeah. Yeah, totally. F there you go. Small fat Char Warrior. Looks like. Tiger, maybe? What's the background noise? It's annoying. Yeah, yeah, oh, this is hair. I'm gonna go with that one. Black hair. And face. Huh. Goes with this one. Looks, looks a little bit retarded. <laughs> with horn, small horns. No one's gonna like this one. It's gonna be real ugly. Guys, he's gonna see good. We need green eyes, brow placement. <laughs> Someone's shooting in the background. Really. Big head. Armor dies. And I'm gonna go with Ebony. Uh, Ebony there. Lower parts. So let's have. Same colors, maybe? So it's fixed with everything else. There and then shoulders. Ebony and ebony. Oh, that looks kind of cool. I think you can find more colors in the game. You can paint whatever you want to. What it depends on what color you find. So yeah, sound from a background. Uh, I wear 
Open face or in this case, open face. Just we will will defeat it. No, I think go with no helm at all. True warrior doesn't need a helm, and my enemies will cringe and falter when they see the fearless determination on my face. Yeah. Trouble may follow me, but I use my. Ferocity. I'm ferocious. Threatening violence get me further than anything else. I'm natural, though I do try to use my powers on intimidation for good. I'm proud to be. I'm proud to be a Blood Legion soldier. I would die for my warband, especially. Ooh. Dinky. This one how in our uh, So he had to be twice as tough just to break even. He gets picked on because he's a god. And not so smart, but I stand by him. He's always been a good friend. They tell me soldiers that side me is a uh, loyal soldier. So yeah, what I choose there was. Uh, the story. So now my story is gonna be a little, a li little different, yeah. But uh, you can change if you sh choose another options. The story will be different. So yeah. And his name's gonna be Mac. Sh Mac. Boogie. Yeah. All right. Here we go. I am a char. In this world of constant battle, I am the deadliest weapon of all. I respect no authority but the clenched fist of my legion. With engines of destruction, we have killed our gods. We reclaimed our homeland of Ascalon, and we planted victory banners on the graves of our enemies. Yet, if we waver, it could slip through our claws. Victory, at any cost. The Blood Legion is my mother. The Blood Legion is my father. We char are born into battle. We live on the fields of war. And I, I will die fighting. I'm a soldier, a ground pounder, frontline infantry. I face the enemy head on. I've earned the respect of my comrades and forge the alliances I can call on in time of need. In the Blood Legion, we're taught the meaning of the word duty. We are relentless. Today, the soldiers of the Black Citadel assault the ghosts that plague this land. I've been assigned to reinforce the Bulwark. Let the Ash Legion strike from the shadows. Let the Iron Legion build its machines of war. I will not stop fighting until the only thing left standing on the field of battle is me. 
This is my story. Well, that was awesome. Fury of the Dead. So yeah. Roll star now. And yep, this is my character. So let's do this. Uh, Fury of the Dead. See the map there, where I'm going. Uh, so this is like a pre over here soldier i've got new pre story quest you need to make this before you can come out to the open world to uh, yeah to the map the big 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 map yep let's do this Just in time, so the ghost almost been in action for the game for me. They finally broke him through, fight our way through the front and report to the centurion Chris Knife for orders for the legions. Fight your way through the front. Yeah. This is gonna be nice. Let's do this. Spam in one. There we go. Let's spam. Hey, more fun. Over here. This is your yeah, so every time you attack you an enemy, you get uh, you level up a new skill. Now you just learn Savage Leap. Which looks like this. your help soldier tribune brimstone has ordered me to the crypt but i'm too torn up to make it what's so important that the blood legion tribune is there the ghost of duke Beridan is far more powerful than we thought his army just broke through our defenses ritlock's about to fight him head on if he succeeds it'll be weeks before the ghost reforms and we can rebuild our perimeter on my way yeah, get to the crypt, guys. The war man scattered. Lots of enemies. Here goes the ghost. Hey, you! Wake up and get over here! Rise for you! So I guess I'm going down there. Where is she? I need to find him. Hamstring. Let's see what happens if I press F1. So hard it'll take him weeks to reappear. Move out. Move out, soldiers. Destroyed ghostly duke. So yeah, this is the first event, event of many events we're gonna see. Oh. 
Where did it go? Oh my god. We're so dead. Mission accomplished. You're heroes now, boys and girls. That was easy. Report back to Smokestead. We are mighty heroes. Plains of Ashford. Now, I'm on my way to the open world. And that's the end of this episode. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, and see you next time.